Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 7th of November 1492, the oldest meteorite with a known date of impact crashed into a wheat field outside the Alsatian town of Ancisheim. A boy from the modern-day French town, which at the time was in a region known as Further Austria, reportedly witnessed the meteorite crash into the ground. Weighing 127 kilograms, that's 280 pounds, its fall through the atmosphere created a fireball that could be seen from over a hundred miles away, and the impact left a one metre deep hole. Locals soon arrived at the site to collect souvenirs, but before long they were stopped by the local magistrate, who kept the stone safe until the arrival of King Maximilian I, who became Holy Roman Emperor the following year. Declaring the meteorite to be a positive omen from God for success in his wars against France and Turkey, Maximilian chipped off some pieces as gifts before entrusting the remainder to the people of Ancisheim. Meanwhile, contemporary satirist Sebastian Brandt composed a poem about the meteorite that was circulated in printed broadsheets in both German and Latin. He suggested that its arrival was a manifestation of God's anger at humankind's wayward and sinful behaviour. In response, the meteorite was fixed to the wall of the church with strong iron crampons to ensure it couldn't escape and cause mischief. The meteorite currently resides in Oncisheim's 16th century Musée de la Régence, although the intervening years have seen souvenir hunters remove more than half of its original mass. These fragments of the oldest meteorite with a precise date of impact can now be found in both museum and private collections around the world. If you enjoy History Pod, please consider supporting it in order to keep the daily episodes like this being researched, recorded and released. Full details are at patreon.com forward slash historypod or you can leave a rating or a review on iTunes, Stitcher or Google Play.